No Cap versus Olo. Chase one, Olo evading. Athletes ready! And it is DeAndre Jones on the chaser's plate. Goes straight up to the mountain to give himself options, but then just sort of saunters around and more speed from Meisel as he goes under the ridge and across court to the tilted cube. And it's nice movement from DeAndre who slides under the mountain, but he's getting absolutely nowhere near and it's a comfortable evasion for Olo who take an early lead. Chase two, Olo evading, one zero, Olo. Athletes ready! Michael Franco, the teenager for no cap. Straight over to the tilted cube and hops over it. Luke Meisel on the move again and on the move quickly. Nearly loses balance and then does. And ultimately, that proves a fatal mistake as Franco makes the tag under the ridge. Chase three, no cap, evading. One, zero, Olo. Athletes ready! Stephen McCarty, he's been one of the standout performers for Team Olo so far in the tournament. And he gets up onto the bars and onto the mountain and jumps down. Chase four, Olo evading, one zero, Olo. Athletes ready! Caden Harbo looking to stop Stephen McCarty from doubling Olo's advantage. Over the cyst as he goes, McCarty, and then stops, jukes one way and goes the other, decides to cut across the front line and again throws one way and goes another. The loading bay before, oh, ow, 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 ow. ow. That is the ridge to the midriff, and it nearly knocks him out the court. He manages to save himself by getting him back in the square, but Caden Harbo can just pick him off. Yeah, you got to watch your routes out here on the quad. There's certain places that are just not ideal to go. Wasn't watching where he's going, and you just got to watch yourself. Chase five, no cap, evading, one, zero, Olo. Athletes ready! Amick Kitson steps up. Caden Harbo hoping to equalize and just threatening to go up the mountain, then deciding against it and goes all the way around the outside. Over the sisters now and to the tilted cube and jittery legs from Caden Harbo. Just suggesting he might go one way. This time he commits to go around the loading bay and it's paid off for him. And we have a level game at one apiece. What a fantastic evasion there. But can I just say, Emic doing that full leap through the loading bay. Didn't slow down, didn't grab a bar. Basically just leaped to his hands like a superhuman. Absolute guts from Emic Kitson. But he just gets fresh air. Chase, six, no cap, evading, one all. Athletes ready! Bailey Harter. This is a guy who injured himself by smashing into the starting plate. We weren't sure whether we'd see him again in this competition, but we are, and he gets the tag pretty quickly to stop Caden Harbo. Chase, seven. Olo evading. One, all. Athletes ready! It's a tight one, this. Where's Preston? Looks for Bailey, who commits early and really goes all the way around. And he's got some speed as he goes under the ridge. Preston looking to cut him off before the mountain, but in the end, he stops and goes again. And this is good. And has he made the tag? He has. He just ran into the sisters and didn't seem to know which way to go, high or low. And in the end, the hesitation cost him. Yeah, the problem from Bailey's point of view here is every time you cut around this corner, you kill all your speed. We saw from the first dash, he had a full sprint. This one was barely a hop and a jump. Chase, eight, no cap, evading, one, all. Athletes ready! The look at the eyes of Fernando Arce, the Olo captain. The velociraptor of a man gets his man in just a few seconds and just prowls off to the mountain. Chase, nine, Olo, evading, one, all. Athletes ready! Mr. Joey Adrian, one of the most decorated parkour athletes on this planet. And the Raptor throws himself over the sisters, goes under the ridge, and Joey Adrian hunts him down. It remains tied at one apiece. It is nip and tuck in this one. Chase 10, no cap, evading, one all. Athletes ready! 
If anyone can make a difference, maybe it is this man, Joey Adrian, who goes and he goes quickly under the mountain. And he looks over his shoulder to find his chaser. He's quite some distance behind, but look at the speed for Joey Adrian. Hops up across cross court and round the loading bay. Rolls under the mountain. <laughs> Superb start from Joey Adrian. The tag he's given. Wait, he's celebrating the evasion. Well, has it been given? I'm confused. Joey Adrian is staying on the court. We've got a referee up with the X in the corner. He thinks he's seen something. I don't think he has seen squat. Emic saying it's not a tag. Joey saying it's not a tag. Well, it's going to go to the DTR, the disputed tag review. And in such a tight game, this could prove to be absolutely crucial. Well, here's the decision. An evasion given. Joey Adrian gets the point. Chase 11. No cap, evading, 2-1, no cap. Athletes ready! Joey Adrian, a legend of parkour, and Stephen McCarty, a new face, but one with raw power and talent, and look at Woo! that! Oh, it's nearly another one who's gone slamming into the boards on the side. Chase 12, Olo evading, 2-1, no cap. Athletes ready! And there we go. We are off and running. And this time McCarty changes tack and goes up the mountain and down again. Now cross court to the ridge. DeAndre Jones in close attention, but McCarty up again onto the sisters. And the tilted cue provides loads of protection and enough to see him get away under the mountain around the loading bay. And McCarty for Olo, he's going to level the game again. And he spins his team through to a two all score line. This one is going right down to the wire, it seems. 10 seconds! Chase 13, Olo evading, 2 all. Athletes ready! Jared Ludi, been very impressive when we've seen him, but so has Stephen McCarty. Said he wanted to bring the steez here in Atlanta, but he just lost his grip, he looks at his shoes, but he's tagged. Chase 14, no cap, evading, 2 all. Athletes ready! Jared Ludi, Luke Meisel tracking him down. Jared just starting slowly and then bursting. And he looked like he might be in trouble, but the tag is claimed and the tag is made. And Jared Ludi waves his finger, he acknowledges it, but he also has to acknowledge that they're in trouble now because Olo are on the brink. It is match point. Chase 15, Olo evading. Match point, Olo. Athletes, ready! Match point, Olo. Franco has to take down Meisel. And he does take him down, and he takes him down very, very quickly. Michael Franco saves the game for no cap. Can he now win the game for them? Chase, 16. No cap, evading. Match point, no cap. Athletes, ready! <laughs> goes straight towards him, go get him, the cry from Team Olo, and he does try to get him through the loading bay, but ends up on the floor. Franco cannot get away this time, though, and that means that it is still 2-2 two, two after all 16 chasers, and once again, we are going sudden death. It's down to who can last longest in these one-off chasers. McCarty versus Joey Adrian in the first of the sudden death chase offs. Sudden death chase off. Chase one, no cap, evading. Athlete ready! Joey Adrian has lasted longer than most in parkour, but can he get anywhere near 20 seconds here? Stephen McCarty with some good pace and crawling under the mountain, but Adrian is off and running, and he's going wide, he goes backwards! Oh my <laughs> word, I've never seen anything like it! I thought he's gonna go backwards under the sisters and then decided to change. The tag is made. We are looking at around the 10 second mark. Let's get confirmation. 10.3 seconds is the official time. Now, it's beatable, but this hangs on a knife edge. Sudden death, chase off, chase two, Olo evading. Athletes ready! And Caden Harbo has him in his sights and he's got less than 11 seconds to catch him. And Bailey Harter goes over the sisters. 
Oh no, and he just wobbles around on the platform and that might be that. Team Olo could be going through to the final. That is it. Caden Harbo just lost his balance on a platform and Bailey Hart at the top of the mountain celebrating because Olo are through to the finals to face Apex. An incredible shootout. And Bailey Harter has pulled himself back up off his sick bed to get the job done.